Hey guys, it's Dr. Nate, and today I'm going to talk to you about why orthodontists take out teeth for braces. All right, so there's kind of three main reasons why we take out teeth for braces. And I mean, there's a bunch of re reasons, but this is the three main ones. So the one, the first, the most obvious is there's no room for the teeth. So you have lots of reasons for this. So sometimes teeth are trying to come in and there's just no space or it's really obvious. You can see on the bottom or the top, the teeth are just you know on top of each other. So there's no room to fit all these teeth in there without taking out teeth. Now some orthodontists, some people will say, hey, you know what, I can fit these teeth in. Even if they're super crowded, I can fit them in. And that is technically true. But what happens, I'll have to kind of turn to the side a little bit, but what happens is if you're trying to fit all these teeth in there and they're really, really crowded, the only spot for them to go is to expand or to go forward. So sometimes we have it where these people had kind of crowded teeth and we try to fit everything in there without taking out teeth. And what happens is their top and bottom teeth look really protruded. So they're coming forward like crazy. So it sometimes looks like they have like a little bit of buck teeth or their teeth are just really coming forward. And one of the reasons for that is because you try to fit everything in there without taking out teeth. Now, sometimes that actually can look pretty good. You know, um, you know, some people have like the Julia Roberts kind of smile where it's big and full and looks, looks kind of protruded, but looks good. And sometimes that looks okay. But then sometimes it just looks terrible and the teeth looks like they're kind of coming right at you, coming really far forward and that does not look good. So that's number one. It's just too crowded. There's nowhere for these teeth to go. So we need to take out some teeth. Um, number two, is sometimes we need it for bite correction. And let me grab these models here. So sometimes what happens is if some people have a really bad overbite, so the top teeth stick out too much. So the top teeth kind of stick out like this, okay? So they're just sticking out too far forward and there's nowhere for them to go. So sometimes we can use rubber bands to correct that or different appliances to correct that to basically bring the lower jaw forward or to help out. So sometimes you can do that depending on how the face looks, depending on how the jaw looks, sometimes we can do that. If you feel kind of like the top teeth basically are sticking out too far, you can take out two top teeth to bring these back a little bit, bring them back, okay? So sometimes they'll take out top teeth if they're sticking out too far to bring those top teeth back. And the, the same goes for the bottom. Sometimes you have an underbite actually just had a patient who just left just a couple minutes ago and that was his issue. Had an underbite, not a, not a jaw issue, it's just the teeth were sticking out too far. So sometimes you'll take out two bottom teeth and basically bring these back so that the bite lines up again. So those are, the, those are two reasons. So it's why they're really, really crowded or sometimes we correct it because there's a bite issue. And the third, probably the next, yeah, third most common reason we're doing it is because the teeth are too protruded or they're coming too far forward, kind of like we mentioned earlier. So sometimes our patients will come in, their teeth actually don't look that bad. You know, they look relatively straight, a little bit crowded, maybe some rotations, nothing too crazy, but they just stick out too much. They're too protruded. They don't like how that looks. So really the only way to fully correct that, I mean, you can do some slimming in between the teeth, which will kind of partially correct it, but to fully correct that to really bring these teeth back to look straight up and down to look a little bit better is to take out some teeth. Normally you'll take out two top teeth and two bottom teeth and bring everything back. So those are those are the three most common reasons. You know, lots of crowding, there's just no room for the teeth or teeth aren't coming in, there's just no room for them. They're just too crowded. You need to take out some teeth. Um, the other reason is bite correction. You know, the top teeth are sticking out too far. We need to take out some top teeth to bring them back or the opposite, the lower teeth are sticking out too much, we need to take out some teeth to bring them back. So sometimes we do it for bite correction. And the last reason, sometimes we do it because the patients don't like how protruded they are. They don't like how far forward the teeth come. So we take out some top and bottom teeth, boom, bring everything back. So those are my top three reasons that I take out teeth for orthodontics, for Invisalign, for braces. Once again, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below and I'll do my best to answer them. Thank you so much.